the hell was that thing? Don't think I want to know. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to Ravenhurst. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go hit some more uh, peel eyes. But before we do that, uh, I want to get started with the, uh, or, or rather, I want to finish, I should say, uh, the, the composting quest. So let's put make that the active quest for the moment. And um, I've been saving up uh, most of the stuff we need in here. So we need three poopies. Um, there, I'll just grab all of this. Uh, we got the coffee beans. We need uh, clay soil, which is in here, I think. And then let's see what else we need. We need plant fibers of 50. And we'll grab those. Okay. Uh, 25 paper. Got that. Five live worms. 50 rotting flesh and 25 nitrate powder. There we go. Okay. So now, um, do we craft that in here? No. Where do we craft it? In here, probably. Yep. Okay. So let's craft the compost. So it looks like this gives us, <coughs> excuse me, gives us five composts. And then I guess we put it in the compost bin. But, uh, but, it, okay, so our, if we're crafting it, compost needs to begin the composting process to make, oh, okay. So, okay, I got you. So we made the compost, but now it needs to be converted to fertilizer. Um, so do we just put this in our toolbar and right click it? Oh, look at that. All right. So now we need to. Okay. So it's just, it's in progress. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, so now what we need. Oh, we, and we have that only used one. Oh, okay. So does one compost make one fertilizer? I guess we'll find out when it's done. Right. Okay. So let's put the, um, let's put the compost in one of these. I'm just gonna stick it in there. Okay, so we apparently we learned the iron hose schematic because it shows that we've learned it, which means we can actually sell it. This is all stuff that I want to sell, which maybe we should do that to just get some coin going. Okay, so now it wants us to craft an iron hoe. And do we do that in here or do we have to do that in the workbench? No, nope, we do it in here. Okay, so we need 16 forged iron primitive handle, leather, and duct tape. Okay, we should be able to do that one right now. Um. Oh, do we not make it in there? Oh, we make it in here. Okay. I wonder why it shows up in the farming table too, though. Maybe because it's part of the quest, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, doc on it. We got to stay in here. All right, here. Let me put a couple things away. Okay, so it said we also need... <clears throat> Uh, a bucket of water. We need to gather a bucket of water. So we need to make the bucket with the seven forged iron. And then a bucket of infected water and coal. Does that mean we have to do that in here? Hmm, I don't know. Okay, well anyways, it said seven forged iron for the bucket itself. Which we can get out of here. And then I'm guessing that we, how much time I got? 30 seconds. Okay. Well, here, we got to be back in here anyway. So I guess we make the bucket itself in here. Whoops. Okay. All right. Let's just stay in here and wait for the, the hoe to finish so we get the credit for it. I'm hoping uh, in Ravenhurst that we can plant directly on the ground like old Old school seven days. I don't like the farm plots. Never have liked them. I think they suck. So, and I really did enjoy hoeing the ground, you know, and, and planting a garden in seven days in, back in the day. Okay, so we got the hoe. Um, we don't have to stay in here for the bucket, uh, but for the water, it's going to want some coal. And I think we used all of our coal to make gunpowder. If we had any coal left over, it would be in here. Um, yeah, so we're going to have to go get some coal. So let's do that. 
I got a pick on me. Yeah. Let's just go grab some from our mine down here. Okay, now let's grab the bucket out of here. And we're going to have to go fill that up uh, with infected water. Okay, so um, a bucket of water. Oh, have oh shit! We have to do this in chemistry station. Okay, well we can do that. Let's go over. We need to go over there and pick up our gunpowder anyway. We're about ready to break this thing, but I need some stamina back here. Alright, so they broke it. We just need to keep them away from the pin bench so they don't damage it. I should probably put a door here or patch this up or something. Alright, well anyway, let's go in here and grab our gunpowder. That's awesome. And then... We want to go here, recipes, bucket of water, and coal. Um, what am I, uh, what am I missing? Doesn't give me the option to do it, right? Oh, maybe it's, maybe it is actually done in the water filtration. Well, let's go back and look at that. There, okay. I don't know, that wasn't that not showing up as active before, or was I imagining things? I don't know. Let's take that thing out. Um, do I have to be... No, it says, it didn't say craft, it said gather, so... I don't need to be in there. Okay, so... Oh, you know what? I don't think we have enough limestone to make another batch of concrete. Yeah, we need more. How much is it? We need 25. Okay. Now, I have more, definitely have more mining in my future. Uh, for sure. Okay, let's grab that. Craft blueberry seeds. All right, so we have a seed package and we have blueberries. I'm assuming we do that in here. Okay. Place blueberry seed. So... Do, do we have to go, like, hold the ground now? Now it's time to use that farm plot. Take the seed pack you were given and use it in the farm table. Craft a blueberry seed and plant, plant it in the farm plot. Plot. In a few hours it will grow and you can be picked. Here are some extra seed packs to help you get started. What farm plot? You never told us to make a farm plot. Uh, what am I missing? Oh, no, we don't have it unlocked. So we do have to use farm plots. Well, what the hell do we need a hole for then? Indispensable tool for plowing the land for farming. Okay, but why do I need this if I have a farm plot? And I don't have the skill for it because we don't have the right level of living off the land. Unlocks the iron hoe and fishing rods. Unlocks the farm table and find fishing. Unlocks wells. We never used to have to... We never used to have to um, have a skill for the farm plot. You can just always make it right away. I'm confused, man. I'm a little confused here. But according to this, the plot's locked. Um... Crafting area workbench. Yeah, it's it's locked. We have living off the land two already. That's for cannabis. That's for beehives. 
Oh, oh so you have to have land lover to make farm plots in, and rain collectors in this mod. Sounds like we have a wandering horde coming through. Okay, well, that puts the, a stop to that for now, then. We made a, a little more progress on it. And I'm going to put this and this in there for now, uh, because we can't really do anything else with it at the moment. Okay, let's grab some grass and some pipes. And let's see how many um, pipe bombs we can make. Okay, 33. That's how many pipes we had, and that leaves a three gunpowder left over. And we need 12 uh, to make one. Do I have a little more gunpowder in here, though? Uh, oh, I do. Okay, so we can make two more exactly. But now we need two more pipes. So let's make those in the forge. Wait a minute. <laughs> I just used up all the iron in the forge. Damn it. Okay. All right, let's put that in there. Do I have any more iron yet? Let's take half of this iron and smelt it down. I mean, I can always go get more, too, so it's not a big deal, really. Let's get, um, where is it? Pipe, pipe, pipe mold. Pipe mold right there. Now, do we have a... I want to look at something here. Okay, so I don't know how, the hell to, how in the hell to get a bullet tip. Because, and I think I showed this to you guys in the last episode, if I try and scrap a bullet, it just gives me brass. It doesn't give me the bullet tip itself. So, um... And, we, you know, we can't make it because we need the mold first to make it. So I'm a little stumped on how to deal with that. This mold can be used to craft. Yeah, I know what the mold's for. How do we get the damn bullet tip? Maybe I have to buy it from the trader. I'm not quite sure about that. Um. Anyway, all right, we need two more pipes. And then we can make two more pipe bombs. And these, of course, we're going to save for Horde Knight 35. I'd still like to have a few more of those, but I don't know that I'm going to have time to get all the way back down south to get more nitrate. Well, no, actually, we do have more nitrate, don't we? Uh, what did I do with that? Yeah, we do have more nitrate. So I, I need to mine some more coal is what I need to do, which I can do because that's just here. All right, so I'll do that later off camera, of course. All right, so we, we got to as far as we could. Uh, with that quest, uh, the stopping point is we either need to get living off the land for, or maybe there's a schematic <coughs> that would allow us to get the farm plot. Um, that's really weird, though, because I don't think, I'm pretty sure we don't need a, any schematic to make one at all in, in vanilla. So I was not expecting that. But, of course, this is Ravenhurst. It isn't vanilla, so, okay. So we need to go do the clear. This one is in this town. Let's make that the active quest. And then we have to go do this one that's 1.1 clicks away. And then we'll have three turn-ins to do. So hopefully if all goes well, we can knock all of that, both of those out and get the turn in. Well, I can do the turn-ins at night. I'm not to worry about that. Uh, but I'd like to get the, the actual questing done uh, before nightfall. Okay, so we're going to redo this guy. That's, uh, what is this? this? Is a fetch. Okay. Oh, man, that didn't reset our table saw, did it? It didn't. Okay. Well, actually, it might actually have, and we just lucked out, and it still works. Hmm. Yeah, we might need to be really careful about that next time. Okay, so we, we need to do a fetch. The fetch appears to be on this floor. Um, I don't think I'm going to do the whole... POI, let's just get the satchel and the fat loots down in the basement. So we're going to need to break through here. Okay, come on out and play, boys. Okay. 
There's a satchel right there. Hot damn. Okay, quest is done. Uh, let's check the sink. Okay, let's go downstairs. Wake up the yahoos down here and take care of them. Come on, boyos. Oh, we got company outside too. We can we can leave the premises because we've already finished the quest. That's a lot of Zeeks. Let's just pull them away because I'm like really low on my shotgun ammo. Okay, I think I pulled the majority of them away. You know, we can handle a couple. We just can't handle a big ginormous group of them. Here, let's put uh, our luckies on. Okay, I'm going to put a couple things in here because we're a bit uh, encumbered. Oh, we never killed you, did we? Let's get in. Let's do this one first, just in case we get overrun again. Uh, oh, nice. We got another hunting knife. Okay. It's a shit one, but it's a hunting knife. Nice. Hunting rifle upgrade. Significant hunting rifle upgrade. Okay, let's get this quick. Okay, we'll take meds. Are you guys going to be stuck up there? That's fine with me. Ronnie McDonnie. We'll play Ring Around the Rosies with oh, you. Oh, no, we won't play Ring Around the Rosies with you. Okay, ammo pile. Come on, give us something good. Uh, nice. Magazine extender. That. Can we put that on here? We cannot. Okay, I didn't think so, but we can definitely put it on here. Very nice pick upgrade. Okay, we'll take that. And then um, we have another working stiffs in here, or some. There's another box of some sort in here. Yeah, it's working stiffs. Okay. Let's check the garbage in case we can find those things. Um, yeah, I'll take those. Sure, why not? And then there's a duffel bag down here. Sports bag. Um, yeah, let's eat those right now. Okay, next quest. Uh, tier 1 clear. And let's see where that's at. That's going to be uh, up north. Okay, so where are we at? Yeah, we're gonna head straight up the road here. All right, I'll meet you guys uh, up in the in the new town. All right, here we are. Uh, this is a clear quest, and um, I'm gonna need to put some some. I'm gonna need to stash some stuff because I'm still over encumbered and we have uh our bike is already completely full so let's see if we can find a duffel bag or a backpack or a purse or anything like that around that's good stuff oh that's a nice big pile of wood there destroyed workbench That's pretty nice find. Oh. 
Thanks for beating the shit out of me, man. Cut that out, Nancy. None of that running business. Are you even... Are you even tagging yet? What are you running for? Okay, Arlene's down and the other Zeke's down. Let's get Steve over here. One Steve, no wonder he's taking so long. Okay, there he goes. Okay, usually just one stab on a crawler is all you need to bleed him out. Alright, you're dead. We need to get our food cap back up here. I'm gonna throw this wood out. And let's just get started here. So this is a clear... I'm not... I don't know that if I'm real familiar with this place, but we don't have time to even think about a double loot. Okay, we're going to have to deal with dickweed there. All right, good. There's a purse. So we can use that to stash some stuff in. Now we have to stay within the area. Oh, I thought there were zombies coming out of there. Doing a little dance, making a little love, getting down tonight. I need these friggin' outside zombos to leave me the alone, man. Are you a T1? Yeah, you are. No wonder you're taking so damn long to kill. Just die, you son of a bitch. Finally. Okay. Now, I hear another zombie somewhere, but I'm not sure where they are. Uh, let's also switch to our, back to our bladed quest here. Um, well, no, we're on the tier one quest, so we're good. Where's that zombie coming from? Up there? I don't know. Well, here, let's just go. So there's apparently nobody in here, so let's rip this back off. Someone just caught on fire. If we're going to make this work, we've got to get, uh... We gotta get the uh, first floor secured for nightfall. Is there something here? No. Medical pile. Oh, good. Beaker. We need one of those. Well, actually, we need two of those. So we got one of two. All right. So this isn't going to secure the ground floor. I bet you there's zombies. Yep. Turn up here. because <laughs> Nice. Nice work. Here, let's get you two. Okay. We'll come back through here and close that and put this down. Hopefully nothing's coming from up above. You know, nothing's coming that way. 
Farmer Brown, will you just die? Son of a bitch. Okay. So we have to... This floor here is not also not secure. Um... Okay, let's get you. I can't put anything there because it's a uh, locked by trash. That's that's weird. Why doesn't that line up? All right, well, he can't get through there regardless, so we're good. All right, he did. Let's check this really quick. We should be okay as long as we don't get any more significant outside interference. Uh, what I want to do is pop this open. Okay. Okay, that is a T1 Arlene, and my god, she's fast. Or no, she's feral. Okay. Alright. I can't tell if there's more zombies behind. Yep, sure enough, look at that. Okay. That's just a normal Darlene, so we're not too worried about her. Soften her up a little bit. Hey, I want to get the kill with the knife so we get the, the credit. Okay, let's get this taken off. Pop one of these two. All right, nobody in here. Let's grab this. Nothing. Toilet pistol? No, dookie though. Not gonna grab that. Okay, what we're going to do here is close that door and bust out through here. And then we're going to have to put down a purse or something. And I'm going to put everything else in here and I can come back for it later or not. Um, doesn't matter. We just don't have time to mess with it. You know what? I'm keeping that. I'm keeping that. Anything that's not super valuable, super essential, etc., etc. And what time is it? Yeah, it's 21:47. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna bust out the top stairs here because I don't. We're not likely to finish this in time. Okay, that should hopefully stop Zombos from coming through here. One thing we could do, too, is just kind of block it further that way. Okay, so we've secured the upper part so we can finish killing whatever Zombos are up here. I'm getting rid of that. Let's put these, uh, no, let's put our bow down here. Oh, none of these boards will break. Yeah, we gotta be careful in here, man. I don't know if, if I trust these boards. There's probably a zombie... Wait, I don't see any place for a zombie to be in here. It, it shows two more that we have to kill. Are they... Oh, up here. <clears throat> gotcha. Okay.
Return to trader. We got her done. Okay. Well, again, my concern is, man, I hope nothing collapses in here. Uh, what we're going to do is we're just going to sprint. Ah! See, 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 see? Okay. Whew. Okay. Let's check the nightstand. Nothing. Ammo pile. Nice. We'll rip off this box. I didn't even... I don't remember what this box was. I was just running in here so fast. It's a chamois box. Okay. How about some food? That's good. That's food. All right. Let's check the fat loots. Another robotic sledge, automatic rifle parts, shotgun parts. Okay. I'm pretty, um, I'm thinking that, okay, it's just that dark part of the floor. I'm thinking that you can't find guns and loot in this game. I'm thinking you have to buy it from the trader or get it as a reward. Purse here. Nice. Okay, so um let's take a look and see where our turn-ins are. We got it. Oh shit! Time to go. Uh we got a turn in at Trader Hugh. Um we probably have one in the desert too for Trader Joel. And that's the one we're the closest to at the moment. Um yeah, so we have a tier one fetch. So let's let's go turn in Trader Joel first. Then we'll cross over to Hugh and then go back down to Trader Bob to finish up. Okay, took took me a couple of attempts to get in here without being totally aggroed, but we still have to be really quiet because, oh shit, if we get, uh, <laughs> stupid snake, if we get, um, you know, a bunch of Zeeks, especially the really nasty ones like the, you know, the feral white dudes, they could break in here really quick. We don't want that to happen. So. Thank you, Survivor. My family and I are in your debt. Here's okay. your reward. Fully automatic mode does one percent more damage per hit until you miss. That's 120. That gets fifty. That's worth 51. That's worth 59. But I can make those. Yeah, I think we're gonna take this. Plus we get 183 dukes. All right, let's take a look at your inventory real quick. Uh, I don't think there's anything in here I want to sell. For now, here we can sell in that. Um. We could we could actually sell him this, but I think this would be worth more because you know we got this new hunting rifle now. Sixty-three versus seventy-two, yeah, quite a bit better. Um, does he have anything we want? Marksman rifle schematic. Yeah, I think we I think we already checked him earlier, and he didn't have anything super phantasmagorical. SMG-5 schematic would be nice. Um, we could potentially get that from him. Uh, and then, um, I don't know if I have enough parts to make an SMG, though. Something to think about. Something to think about. Okay, so this is only worth 45 by itself. But if we scrap it, and I have a bunch of rifle parts already back at the base anyway. 
um, we can sell it for 108. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Let's eat this. I thank you, kind sir. And then just take another job from him. Okay, so I don't want to do anything to the east of here because it's going to be in the desert. And I'd <coughs> rather not work in the desert. Uh, so southwest is going to be in near our town. And that's a fetch. Clear, fetch. Yeah, let's Another let's do this one. Predicament. Could yeah, that's that 7-Eleven store. God okay. Bless you and good luck. All right, let's get out of here. You know what? We're just going to run for it. Let's go, let's go. All right, I saw a vulture around, so we might attract his attention, but we're, we're not going to stop until we get out of the desert, uh, which means we need to be going west here. Okay, so I'll meet you guys over by Trader Hugh, and we'll get that turn in taken care of. I'd like to actually get into Tier 2, because we're going to get more money um, from that, and presumably better weapons and whatnot. Was that thing? Don't think I want to know. Okay, I think I've finally shaken all the Zeeks. Goodness. Let's uh take this moment here to uh, fill the gas tank back up. Whew. All right. Um, let's grab a couple things we could sell to him. Yeah, we can sell those rifle pieces. We might need these for something. Let's we can sell the steel polish. And I think we want to keep everything else. Do these have a recipe? A usable toilet. We need three gold nuggets. Okay. We'll sell three then. Let's go. Hopefully there's no zombies inside here. There has has been before. Oh, we are like super hungry too. Tell me that wolf's outside. Did we ever go loot upstairs here? I don't remember. I sure doubted it. But you okay. Tech Junkie Volume 4, chance for power attacks to instantly charge stun batons. Nah. Why couldn't you give us shotgun ammo, man? We've already done Pistol Pete Volume 7, but we could take it to sell it. We don't have a Magnum right now. We may not for quite some time, so let's take that. Oh, nice. Finally, we're done with Tier 1. Okay, that's fantastic. Uh, Sniper Volume 6, 7.62 ammunition, do more damage against armored opponents. Yes, let's take that. And we get uh, 1050 Dukes. All right, let's take a look at your inventory. I want to sell this to you. Sell these to you. This pistol peaked. And I think that's all we want to sell to him. Let's take a look at his inventory. He's got that really shitty pump shotgun. And I just don't I don't think I'm gonna take that because I can't repair it. Once it breaks, it breaks. I think we've, yeah, we must have already looked at his inventory because I remember looking at that shotgun. 
Oh, um, yeah, we were thinking about this, actually. The purple AK. I mean, that's that's within reach if we keep just cranking out these quests. Right, I remember that now. Okay, so um, he restocks on day 36. Uh, what day is it now? Was there something else? Day 34. Um, so, yeah, oh, man, tomorrow's horde day. We'd have to raise uh, that money by the end of... Well, by tomorrow afternoon and give us enough time to get back to our horde base. Okay. All right, well, let's go. You know, I've got so much 762 now that I'd really be nice to have a an AK. Oh, shit, there's a zombie right there. All right, let's run. Time to go. Okay, so um, we're going to go back to uh, uh, we're gonna go back to our hometown, which is our third turn in. Do that, and then we need to wrap up this episode. And then we'll figure out what our next maneuver is in the next episode. Lord, I owe you one. Okay, good. So we get some 9 mil ammo from him. Uh, or Wasteland Treasure Volumes 2. Harvest Coffins for Bones, Jewelry, and Precious Chips. Nah. Uh, I think I'm going to take the ammo. So let's complete the quest and then he should yeah, special jobs, let's take that. A task for you, friend. That'll if take us interested. back to Trader Joel in the desert and then Brilliant. we can start uh tier yeah, two. Makes us friends so I don't now. think oh no, he will give us tier twos right now. Okay, well that's good. Um this one is right in town here. Um this is a fetch and clear. Can you do me a favor? A Wookie house werewolf and yeah, okay, whatever. We'll take that one. Oh, thank you very much. I will make it worth your while. Oh, that's that house. Okay. Well, we wanted to We wanted to finish it anyway, so now we have a reason, but I think I'm going to actually try and double loot it because um I think the loot's all the way up at the top. Uh, that's going to be quite a fight, though, isn't it, if we try and double loot it? And well, unless we unless we ninja up the side and not go through the whole house. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Okay. You, do, you don't get much closer than that to the trader. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's like just right across the street, quite literally. Uh, okay, guys. Well, anyways, um, that's it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and um, we will... Go ahead and plan on just hitting this uh, in the next episode. I don't know. Um, like I said, I don't know if we... I mean, we could probably raise the 8,000 and some odd coin for the AK. But, hmm, I don't know. It's going to be... It's going to be close. So we might... Uh, we might just have to pass that one up. I don't know. We'll have to see. Can I walk with that much? Yeah, I'm still... Oh, nope, I can't. <laughs> Couldn't quite get to the ladder either. Crap. Okay, so we're going to put a couple things back in here. Anyway, I'm going to let you guys go. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.